Good morning, everyone, and welcome to the YouTube Bible Art Hop. I hope you are all having fun hopping right along, and um, I'll introduce myself. I am Lynn from Lot 95 Designs, and I am the creator of the Praise and Pray journal series. This, um, they are colorable devotionals that also come with colored elements, stickers, strips, lots of fun and um, the journal that I'm working on right now is the fifth one in our series is the peace journal we just finished let go and let God where we got rid of some anxiety and stress and worry and now we're working on finding peace so we're doing peace with a little bit of a hippie twist so the journal is basically colorable there's also scripture writing pages that you can incorporate into your journal if you'd like lots of fun elements of polka dots and stars and hearts and little tabs and tags and words and it's just a really great journal to work in when I started creating them I had no idea how this would touch my life we also have a praise and pray journaling group on Facebook and we're 800 members strong so excited and we share our journals and worship and inspiration and tips and techniques and mostly friendship and worship together so there that was just a few of the pages from the journal I will leave um, a link to Etsy that's where they're at I try to make them affordable for everybody and we have some great sales and coupons and in our group I do tons of giveaways and freebies and we have so much fun love for you to join us so today this is one of the pages I haven't done this one yet this is one of the coloring pages um, it always comes with a poem and there's some prayers so today I want to work on the prayer pages so I'm just going to do a quick technique today and I'm gonna use sprays so I have delusion sprays I have purple and I have sort of a teal color so that's what I'm gonna use for these and maybe a squish of pink cuz I like pink so very easy just spray and I may go back later and do some coloring with the elements sometimes I just like to leave them black or line drawings I should say maybe we'll add a little pink fun in there and then we just give it a dry I'm just going to take some of that off and then I'll just move all this stuff put it on my desk give it a dry and we can move on so I hope everybody's having fun hopping along. I am so thankful to the ladies from Spread the Word Facebook group for inviting me to the hop. Such a great idea. I love watching YouTube videos of Bible journaling and I've been Bible journaling for just a little over a year now and having so much fun. I came out with the journals in April and everyone's working on a different journal. Some of us are working on the first journal some of us are working on the last journal it's all just really fun so what I'm gonna do is just let this dry up a second and I'll grab my journaling strips and we'll get to work be right back hey okay, we're back so uh, our spray is dry I've got some fun little elements cut out there was a sticker sheet of tabs and tags and words and flowers and clouds and butterflies so I cut some of those out and for those of you that don't know me, um, I have essential tremors. So my hands shake a lot and I don't do much handwriting. So I do all my journaling on a computer. So I do a lot of journaling strips. Um, with each journal, there are readings and devotional questions, but I always leave a page just for your personal prayers. So this is mine for today. Dear Lord, grant me the grace to keep walking one foot in front of the other no matter how impossible the mountain feels to climb lead me by streams of your living water refresh my soul take my burdens that await me and give me a new song to sing renew my faith and let me see the blessings I pray this in Jesus' name all men so then what I do now is I take my handy dandy jar of yes paste for those of you that follow along with my um, technique Thursday video series we're always trying a new technique on Thursday and my favorite 
tool in the world is this big gallon of Yes Paste. This is how I glue everything down. I have this huge jar and this is my go-to glue. It is amazing. So it's just, it's really fun. I tell you ladies. So I hope everybody's having an awesome Saturday. I know it's a great day here. I live in Canada and um, you know it's October now and it's fall time in Canada. So I'm thinking I need to go live in Arizona or California. Somewhere where it's warm and I don't have to see snow because I know that's coming. It's coming fast. Alright, so we're just going to glue those down and I'm not going to bore you with all that and I will come back and we'll finish off our page. Be right back. Okay, we're back. I'm just going to glue down these last few elements and um, then do another little fun technique. I love Bible journaling as I'm sure you all do too and there's so many different ways to do it. I have a Bible journal that I do a lot of watercoloring in. Um, I have a prayer journal. I do prayer cards and now the journal and I love creative worship. I love spending time in his word to be able to create and I find I just meditate on the verses more as I'm creating and as I'm drawing or coloring or whatever I'm doing I find I keep thinking about the scripture. I don't just read it and it's made such a difference in my prayer life and in my regular day-to-day -day life. I always say to my group, I can't go by without a day of creative worship. I just can't. I'm just going to do this little tab here. And it's Saturday. So we're going to do that. And Lynn should have folded it first. I love doing things like that. So I'm just going to pop that on here. And then I'm going to do just a little tag as well for the top. Little word piece, because our peace journal. And since it's October, our new journal just got released. And it's a gratitude journal. And also um, a journal of Noah. And what is your purpose in life? That seems to be a topic that a lot of my group wanted. So what my group wants, they get, I tell you. And freebies. Oh gosh, do we love freebies. Okay, so there we go. Now my other fun tool, if you know me, because I'm kind of crazy, is um, I love my black Bic Velocity pen. This pen writes on anything. So what I do is I just outline my journaling strips in it. And maybe this one will use the white Signal Uniball because our background is so dark. I'll just go along with this and we'll do this. Sorry to interrupt everyone, but my puppy, I have a couple golden doodles and she's ringing the bell to go outside. She wants to go outside so bad. So I'm just going to go open the door for her and I will be right back once again. Alrighty, I'm back. I love to keep it real. My camera battery died. The dog has to go outside. I just keep on filming. What a fun day. It's such a great day at my house. My husband went on a kayak trip with his buddies. My son is visiting his sister about three hours away. He still lives at home with us. And uh, so it's just me and the puppies. So wow. I just texted my girlfriend and said it's frozen pizza and create day today in the studio. I'm all alone. It's going to be a fabulous day. I love my creative worship time. So just going to go around these and uh, we'll do this one. I like to make squiggles and wiggles and all kinds of fun things. And maybe some of just little zigzags around some stuff and all fun. So the next thing I'm going to do is just grab some modeling paste and just add a little bit of texture to the journal. I just love adding little bits and pieces of all kinds of stuff. So I'm going to grab out a stencil. This one is called Mini Textured. Jaxi, they're barking at a bunny rabbit right now. And I'm just going to take the texture paste. To me, it looks like glue if you've never used it before. And you just need a little bit on a spatula or a popsicle stick or however you want to put it on. You can color it. 
I just did a video where I colored the um, texture paste and used it in my big Bible journal. So I'm just going to do that and maybe some textured dots because I love polka dots. If you uh, follow my YouTube channel or, or a friend of mine on Facebook, you will soon see that I have a little bit of a thing with polka dots. My cover photo is my polka dot shoes my daughter and I bought. Love polka dots. And I'm really loving these little dots. They're going to really pop with the texture paste. And maybe a few more little globs. Let's not hit the camera. Let's try to stay in focus. I'm so excited to make this video for everybody and to be part of the Spread the Word Facebook group. What a bunch of lovely ladies. They made me feel so welcome there and I'm so pleased. I just love groups where we share devotion and community. It's a, just a beautiful thing. I am so happy I found Bible journaling. This is great. Okay, so we're done with that. We'll clean that up in a little bit. We'll just put that off to the side. And then I think I'm going to finish off with some stamping. I'm um, trying to think which, where my stamps are. Here they are. I love these Dilutions in Betweenies. I especially love this one. Looks like stitches to me. So I'm just going to grab that out. It's one of my go to stamps and just grab the black stays on. And I'll also have links for all the supplies I've used in the video at the bottom of the YouTube channel along with all the links for the hop. So I just love to add some stitching in just random places, maybe some on the flowers. It just, to me, gives that little bit of oomph. And I'm just doing stamp to pad right now so that I can use the stamp and maneuver it to where I want it to go. So we'll just put some here and there. And that's lots of fun. Maybe a little bit there. A little bit on the flower. I love to stamp. I love to get messy. I just love to have fun. And forgot to turn off my phone. Wow, you guys are seeing the real me today. <laughs> We've got everything going here. So there's our finished page. Thank you again so much for joining me. Stop by Praise and Pray Journaling on Facebook, grab some freebies, come have some fun. I was so excited to join you all today. Have a blessed day. God bless. See you next time. Bye-bye.